Hi YouTube, this is part of my tribute to my mohawk because my name on YouTube as a user is Mohawk Girl and in my last two videos I haven't even worn it up. And I look like crap today because I went camping last night and it was like 32 degrees or something like that. We didn't really sleep because it was cold and staying alive and warm was more important than sleeping like it usually is. My hair was like down to my back, lower back, when I first got my mohawk done. So that was pretty awesome. Uh, I donated it to the Dove for Dove Women Hair Campaign thingy for people with cancer and other horrible things like that to make their hair fall out. And I figured since I was only going to be spiking about eight inches of mine, that you know they could have the other foot and a half they cut off because it was literally that long. It was ridiculous. Um. I don't know if it's being a girl, but when you're a girl and you get all your hair shaved off and you've never had it like that before, it is one of the most liberating things you can ever do for yourself. And I know there's a lot of girls out there that would be too scared to shave their head, but if there's girls out there that are able to get a mohawk and that could get a mohawk and think they'd be able to survive having a mohawk, fucking do it. I don't know where or who I would be without mine. And that's kind of why I have to do this video tribute, because it has been such a big part of the past four years of my life, and it's a fucking hairstyle. I mean, but right, so I'm going off to college here soon, and uh, I guess it's time to be serious. A little more serious. I don't know. I've got extensions. Like, I could get away with wearing a faux hawk and having extensions and have long hair during a normal business day when I need to be doing school or doing things for chemical companies, whatever. But a faux hawk just isn't going to do it for me. It really isn't. So, this is the video tribute to my mohawk. This last picture that I'm about to show you guys is uh, pretty sweet, if I do say so myself. I went to junior prom in a red strapless gown that I bought at a store. I purchased some plaid fabric, some uh, leather with um, silver circles punched. I don't know what that's called for real. Um, <laughs> I got iron-on, glue-on studs, I got black lace, I got velcro, I don't know, I just got all this stuff, and I personalized my prom dress. I was, it was, it was my punk rock prom, it was pretty cool, um, and it does have a Misfits patch on it, which is, which is awesome, because Misfits are great, but you kids need the Misfits with Danzig, not the other guys. They are right. But you need with Danzig first. If you want to call yourself a true Misfits fan, you listen to the Misfits with Danzig. And realize that he wrote more songs than Mother. Okay? Uh, I had to destroy a Misfits shirt to put that patch on the dress. 
That was pretty depressing. But uh, this is Junior Prom, and I hope you enjoyed my mohawk as much as I did. Thank you.